Okay, it's uh, it's now been uh, about been about 45 minutes since I started it. Uh, you can see from the fire indicator right now she's running right about 500 degrees. Um, I got a heat gun and I put it on various parts. Um, the section up here under the uh, under the water bucket is running about 650 to 700 degrees. Um, down here as you can see about 500. Um, what's really neat about this is down on the uh, down on the outside, like right here, it's only like 70 degrees. I mean, you can see I can put my hand on it. So, 700 up there, <laughs> 70 down here. This would be a pretty safe unit to use on a deck. Um, down at the bottom, of course, there's like nothing. I mean, it's just cold down there. But um, it's working pretty good. I, I think that the, the pan that I used up top, I probably should use if I can find a like a pizza pan that might be 16, 18 inches stainless steel and um, push the heat down a little bit more and push it out more towards you know uh, people on the deck it might even stay uh, you know might warm you up that much more but uh, it's doing a heck of a job for the size that it is as you, as you can see um, so that's pretty much it uh, looks like the efficiency is going pretty well um, it's been burning 45 minutes and I don't even think it's gone through a quarter of its fuel. So that would probably be a pretty good indication it's going to be, you know, probably over two and a half hours burn time. Uh, the water's been on top for just a short period of time. It's already up to 180 degrees in the, in the bucket. So. It's, as you can see now, it's it's getting ready to boil. So, uh, looks like everything's working out pretty well. So, anyhow, that is the, um, you know, the, the whole fireplace thing that I intended to do. And it looks like it's working for 50 bucks. You certainly can't beat it. Um, next project I hope to do would be a, uh, a rocket heater. I uh, want to kind of compare the two and see which one puts out more heat. Alright, I'll see you all later on YouTube World. Bye.